Welcome to Kembar. As you guys saw in the opener, Kembar is located in the jungle in Playa Palada in the Nosara area. Yeah, actually the name Kembar means twins in Indonesian. So you can see why with the two units that look the same, but just reverse layout. So yeah, these are the twins, Kembar. Yeah, yeah exactly. So uh, we're here thanks to our friends. They, this is their dream two years ago and now it's a uh, come to fruition. So amazing to see. Yeah, we remember them talking about it and coming and showing us the piece of property that they had purchased in person and looking at it and saying, oh, yeah. one day, you know, it's going to take a bit of time, but one day it's going to be built and it's here and it's just absolutely amazing. Yeah. Super comfortable, just very, yeah. very serene, very peaceful, sounds of the jungle all around. So yeah. we've really enjoyed our stay here. So our friends Dan and Brittany Bremnis, as well as John and Jessica Steingard invited us to stay here as their first guests. That was amazing. Thank you guys for letting us stay. Yeah, it was honestly an honor because I've known Dan since I was about two years old. I swear we were in diapers together, <laughs> playing yeah. around. And uh, his wife Brittany, uh, we went to school together and I'm really close friends with her family members and stuff like that too. So yeah. just to see like over time, you know, like how much we all develop and change and end up in other countries <laughs> creating pieces of paradise and stuff like that and having our little our little spots to go stay at in different countries and stuff like that it's like it's just nice and it's it's just a joy and a pleasure to to see everybody grow that way yeah exactly and be able to uh, have places like you said in paradise so mm -hmm. we actually met john and jessica through uh, dan and Brittany, so it was really cool to meet them um dan's actually a singer songwriter uh, based out of nashville and then john was the singer and guitar player for hawk nelson the band hawk nelson yeah they uh, they continue their careers. Uh, John now does uh, video production. He does music videos for Dan, and they just love to live in the dream. Live in the dream, yeah, <laughs> and have a place in paradise. So yeah, we're very fortunate to stay here. We've actually been here for two nights already. Typically, when we do videos, we kind of vlog the whole time that we are at a place, but we wanted to do a little bit of a mix up here. Kind of enjoy our stay, film as we're going, and then share with you our experience here at Kembar. So uh, yeah, it's uh, with the two units. You, you can rent each unit individually or you can rent the whole property as well. So if you're coming with your family, your friends, you can actually have everybody on the same property. It's amazing to, to be able to have that area for uh, for everyone to enjoy. I can definitely agree that Kembar is super comfortable. We had a couple really great night's sleeps. It's just very peaceful here in the jungle with all the little sounds of the birds and occasionally the howler monkeys yeah. even, which is still music to my ears <laughs> is, after yeah. all these years of living in Costa Rica. It never gets old. So there's some monkeys in the tree here in the jungle behind Kembar. So when you stay here, you can see them jumping across. It's not really picking up on the camera, but when you stay here, you get to see howler monkeys right in the back. Anyone could definitely appreciate a longer stay here in either one of the units as there's things like a washer and dryer, yeah. fully functioning kitchen, full size appliances. So it's easy to be very comfortable and just settle here and just have this as a place to stay for your vacation for however many days you want. So yeah, while we've been here, we've enjoyed our stay. We've gone for dinner at La Luna. So there's a lot of restaurants close to Kembar as well. La Luna is one of the most popular and you're going to see why because of the sunset. It was amazing that night. Yeah, pretty much every time we come to yeah. Nosara, we go to La Luna. We yeah. have to. Yeah. And they have good breakfast and lunch and stuff too but it's definitely a, a, sunset, a sunset spot spot for sure yeah so yeah it was amazing as always and then uh the next night we went to the sunset beach which is close by as well i'm going to show you some footage of that with the drone as well as a time lapse of the sun going down that's a popular place for a lot of locals again close by it's not very far so you can actually walk there i think it's about a 10 minute walk or 15 minute walk so So yeah, as we just said, we're here at Sunset Beach, which is very close to Kembar. It's uh, beautiful. There's a island right there. Obviously, high tide, it's connected. So right now, you can actually walk across if you wanted to. But yeah, everybody comes here, hangs out, has a beverage, 
enjoy sunset. Nice thing with sunsets here typically is, well I guess it's everywhere, but once the sun sets it actually lasts for a while. Um, not as much cloud tonight, but it still should be a, a nice color for a little bit. So yeah, we're gonna hang out here and uh, something you guys should do when you come stay at Kembar. And then we went for dinner at a place called Local. Again, there's a lot of good restaurants in Nosara, so you're gonna be able to enjoy all that. Another thing about Kembar as well is it is close to a major supermarket. Uh, Rindle Mass is the big one that I'm showing you right now. Um, you can get anything you want. Having the full-size kitchen, you can cook your meals here as well, so it's, it's nice to have that. As well as the only gas station in this area is about five minutes away, so don't worry about your rental car, your quad or something running out of gas, you were super close to that. I want to mention too, for families, they have just, built a skate park and there's a climbing wall there's a basketball net there so if you are coming with kids and they do skateboard or they like those kind of activities just know that it is close by we actually enjoy going there quite a bit i was going to say too we heard that there's a farmer's market twice oh, yeah. a week here we think maybe one of the days might have been tuesday but we didn't know tuesday, for yeah. sure yeah um so i'm thinking maybe tuesday and saturday but it might change throughout the year depending on high season or low season but we've heard nothing but great things about the local farmer's market too so mm -hmm. if you want to go check that out and have some local food and see some things from the local artisans yeah. That's always a must when you're here. Yeah, and the property manager has been really great as well. So if you have any questions about the area, if you want to book any tours, if you want to do uh, book an ATV, stuff like that, they can help you out. Uh, very responsive. Uh, the, yeah, uh, you guys picked, awesome a really good, yeah. picked a really good property manager for this place. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it's nice to have those people in the area that are very familiar with the area. But yeah, other than that, we uh, enjoyed coffee in the pool in the morning, listening to the howler monkeys, the birds. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, it's super secure here. There is alarms on the, the place as well so when you leave you can set the alarm and it does have the automatic gate as well so you definitely don't have to worry about feeling uncomfortable as far as uh, security goes they've done a really good job with that as well yeah as far as the little details like Shana said that they source locally made furniture here in Costa Rica which is really cool to be able to support the locals and as many of us know people like us that have lived here for a while or anybody that's building down here there are a lot of beautiful things in Costa Rica, but there's just certain things that you want or yeah. you need for your property. You want to have a certain look or yeah. a certain theme. Yeah. Or you it's see something online, you're like, stuff, yeah. oh, I love that. I want to put that in my rental or put that in my house. 
not always easy to find in a small yeah. country. And personally being friends with Brittany and Jess and knowing that they have a similar eye for design like I do, uh, right away you can see it throughout the entire place. Yeah. They've just done an amazing job. They were able to source the brass faucets and some of the other fixtures and stuff from Morocco. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. So yeah. there's a little touch of Morocco in here and even the letters for the Kembar sign at the front of the property, they source those from Turkey. So even things like that, it's just those cool little details that make all the difference of how the overall space feels. Yeah, exactly. And that's that's the nice thing about design. You can make it feel a certain way and make it comfortable for people to yeah. come and stay and uh, have a really relaxing vacation here in Costa Rica. So anyone that wants to visit Nosara, Costa Rica for their vacation, this is definitely the place to stay. Yeah, for years we've had guests stay at Sea Casa Samara, ask us where we recommend in Nosara. We never had a place that we could recommend. Well, now we do, and it's friends of ours that own the place, so it's even better. If you'd like to book your stay here at Kembar in Nosara, just visit their website, which is in the description below this video. Again, if you liked the video, please leave a thumbs up. If you haven't yet, hit the subscribe button, hit the little bell icon to get notified when we come out with new videos, and we'll see you in the next one. Ciao. Always keeping us restless with the lights.